families um, experienced uh, real difficulty with um, kids who went off the rails due to anxiety, depression, computer addiction, drug addiction. Um, and these are things that despite the fact that we don't talk about it a lot are affecting many, many families across the country. Singing Vanilla Pines for the students here was just remarkable. You know, getting to see them, and they were singing with us, which was absolutely the best part. On fire. Four walls bound us no longer. Four walls bound us no longer. We could do more than survive. Let's light this house on fire. Despite like all the love in the world, sometimes it's hard to communicate with the people you love and hard to get them to understand you and for you to understand them. To be able to put on a theater piece, it really just, it literally opened up the dialogue. You guys are doing a plan of subject matter that does not get talked about a lot in mainstream media. Um, and from what I got from the song, it was pretty uplifting. I can only imagine what would have been my life if a show talking about issues like these had existed. It's, it's more about general, in general, about mental health issues, and that could be, you know, experiences that people have on an outpatient level, on an inpatient level, or anything else. It's really It benefits all of us <laughs> if issues around kids' mental health and adolescent mental health become part of a broader conversation. To spread love through the show and to shed some light on things and erase the stigma and erase the shame that you're alone in this because you're not. Stands hard like vanilla pines. Every day is another dry and chew.